what's up everyone tech cloud here and in this video i'm going to show you a walkthrough of the hardware design of sony xperia z2 this is a beautiful device so i thought uh, i should uh, give a overview of the complete uh, hardware and different elements of uh, this beautiful device so that uh, you can have a look at it uh, more closely so let's start Sony Xperia Z2 has stereo speakers and one of those speakers actually is located at the bottom and you can see this horizontal uh, slot this is basically one of the speakers and the other speaker is located at the top and again you can see a small horizontal slot this small hole on the top is basically the noise cancelling microphone and it is actually difficult to spot uh, these slots when you are uh, looking at the device for the first time this will either give you a illusion there are no speakers or you will find that these three dots might be the speaker actually they are the mic and uh, all the audio will go through these uh, mics underneath the top speaker is the notification led and the color of the notification led will be actually governed by the app it belongs to on right hand side there are actually two main buttons located one of them is the power button and the other one is the volume rocker and they are made of metal and uh, speaks about the quality of the build as well as the device and if you go above the power button there lies the micro sd slot as mentioned on that uh, flap there is small uh, groove available so that you can open the flap easily and the phone can take uh, 128 gigabyte uh, micro sd card If you flip to the other side you will find another flap and there is also a groove available to easily open that flap and underneath uh, that flap lies the micro USB port as well as the micro SIM card slot. Combining the SIM card slot with the USB port under the same flap is kind of uh, strange to me but Sony must have their uh, very good reasons to do that. Opening the flap every time to charge your uh, device is kind of pain so in order to fix this problem Sony has uh, provided the desktop uh, charger which can actually connect to these connections as you can see on your screen. If the charger does not uh, come in the box you can always buy it separately. On the front of the device there lies a 2 megapixel front facing camera which is actually located on the right of the big uh, sony logo that uh, you see on the front and underneath the top speaker on the top uh, also lies the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and uh, thankfully there is no flap for the headphone jack and it is uh, waterproof without any flap sony xperia phones have uh, big uh, bezels on the sides and the top and the bottom but this time actually they have managed to reduce uh, the bezel somehow the bezels are still not as small as uh, some of the devices available in the competition like samsung and lg devices but it's uh, much better than before on the back is the trademark 20.7 megapixel camera and this is the XMR RS sensor from Sony and the lens is the Sony G lens the sensor size is 1 by 2.3 inch and underneath the camera is the flash which is a single LED flash if you go further down you will find NFC and if you go further down there is a big Sony logo over there as well so Sony want to make sure that you know it is a Sony device Thankfully, there is no Xperia branding. So in order to fire up this uh, 20.7 megapixel camera, the shutter button is available on the right hand side bezel. And 
if you hold it uh, for a few seconds it will actually launch the camera app so guys uh, this was just a quick uh, walkthrough of the hardware design of the sony xperia z2 and if you like such kind of videos then do let me know and i will make uh, similar sort of videos about the htc one m8 and the samsung galaxy s5 as well so guys i will see you later in some other video take care bye